Hi, my name is Vernon Johnston, also known as Vito. I have the website called www.phkillscancer. Now, a lot of people have asked me, they said, Vito, can you make a video of how you mix the baking soda solution? That's the baking soda, the molasses, and the water. They want to know how I'm mixing it and how I did mix it. Two years ago, I got, actually it was a little over two years ago, I got a diagnosis from two sets of doctors that says, well, Mr. Johnston, you've got... Uh, prostate cancer, stage four, that metastasized to the bones. And that means terminal, that means toast. And I didn't really know what to do, and I was fortunate that my son, he says, Dad, try looking at pH. Sometimes when you change the pH of your body, things happen. And so what I did, I made up a baking soda molasses water solution. And I'm gonna show you how I did that. Right now I'm doing, this is over two years later, I'm still alive, and I'm doing uh, on the website, www.phkillscancer.com, I'm doing a, oh, more or less a tune-up of alkaline in my body. So this is, this is the baking soda. I'm, I'm right now at the stage of putting two teaspoons in. So here's one teaspoon, and that's two teaspoons. I'm going to add a teaspoon of molasses. Now this is, that's a teaspoon of molasses. This is a soft science. And I'm going to put in about a cup of water. All right. I'm going to stir it. Now this is what I did during my whole protocol that you'll see on the website. And then I would drink this. You see it going all over the floor, Mark? <laughs> Mark's going to clean up when I get the, the... No, I'll clean up. What I would do, and then I would go ahead and drink that. What I'm doing now is the first part of the protocol that I'm doing now. I'm doing about 12 days of this protocol to raise my pH up to a certain level. I am going with Don's protocol and you can see what his protocol is on the website also. Don used basically the protocol that I have on my website and he adjusted it a little bit. What he did, he warmed the water up so that the baking soda dissolved in it first. But tell you, this worked for me. I'm very happy. Well, let's go ahead. I'm going to set this to the side right now and then I'm going to do the baking soda in the pan and in the water. So first I'll put on Mr. Stove, I'll put in a cup of water that I'm going to use, okay, cup of water, two teaspoons of baking soda, you know, baking soda is really not that expensive, and I know it's a, I know it's a lot less expensive than what other people. You can see it there, Mark. Can you take a look how it's sitting there? Now watch how quick this, watch how quick that dissolves. Now, I have gas at home. I'm using Mark's range right now. You, can you see that, Mark, in there? It's a little cloudy. Yeah. Okay. Pretty soon it'll be nice and clear. And actually what I've discovered is this goes down a lot easier uh, than when I just used what I did over two years ago. But again, I'm very happy with this one. All right, that's pretty clear. Let's add that teaspoon of molasses. There's... Looks good to me. We'll stir that up there. Looks like artwork, doesn't it? Now we can shut this stove off. There it is, there's the solution. And I'm gonna pour it in here. I'm gonna let that cool before I drink it. 
Now, while that's cooling, actually that's getting pretty close, you didn't take much. This is, this is the baking soda I use. A lot of people, they confuse baking soda with baking powder. Baking powder has aluminum in it, so you don't want to use baking powder, you use baking soda. Some people use this one or they think they get uh, Bob Mills uh, baking soda. Uh, this one's just fine. It was certainly fine for me two years ago. Let me check the temperature of this. Now, what, I, what I'm at, I started at one teaspoon a day, and that was seven days ago, and then I went to one teaspoon twice a day, and then I gradually worked up to two teaspoons uh, twice a day, and now I'm working at two teaspoons three times a day, and this is my second day of this. My pH has risen significantly. I check it with litmus paper. All that information is, is on the, actually it's on the blog on the website, so you can access that. And maybe by the time uh, you see this video, um, the protocol that I'm doing now may be already over, but I'll still keep it on my uh, website and on the blog. So, uh, cheers. Bad. Again, if you want to learn more about this protocol, check it out at the website. And I think Mark's going to put a little, what do you call him, a little banner, Mark? He's going to put a little banner explaining a little bit of this and that. So there you have it. That's how you make two different versions of the baking soda molasses uh, uh, concoction. I actually I call them cocktail once in a while and this is what I use to reclaim my health. Thanks very much.